Hey everyone, welcome back to the place where we're testing every single mask on Amazon, even the very popular CureAd Germ Shield 9000. I made the 9000 up. Medical grade face mask. This is this is a hell of a box right here. Let's get into this guy and see what's going on here. Ooh, ooh, not focused. That's what's going on here. Um, so, oh, that's interesting. I've never seen like a pocket, a square box like this. Unique. It's got the the hanger on there. 99% bacterial filtration, which doesn't matter for COVID. So this is clearly marketed to consumers, individually sealed, which is really awesome. Medline, one of the biggest manufacturers of medical face masks. And exciting, we are doing the old clamper. The old clamper's back. And why is it exciting? Well, because, wow, those are, that, that's a lot of fabric, which is gonna help the breathability when you wear that. Why does it matter though? Because now you can see me almost like clamp my fingers again. Which is why most of you started following us, I think. You just want to see the pain. All right, Medline. Been making masks for a long time. They uh, contract manufacture. They use other people to manufacture. I think they asked us if we would manufacture for them, actually. Um, and family owned, not anymore. They just sold actually for like $30 billion or something to a private equity group. Um, this is made in Vietnam. This is the first Vietnam, Vietnamese mask that we've had in here. That's super cool. And I love the train conductor design. It's a very quality mask. Like this thing, this is like the nicest surgical mask from a physical standpoint that I have ever seen. Individually sealed, look at this. The folds are in and then do you see this? Nice, soft, like thick layer of like foam or something. That's to give you an extra seal there. I've heard about these masks. It's really good. And then this one has got this uh, special fold not the normal fold but if you look at that long enough like you it's like hypnotizing me hypnotizing myself and then the nose wire is all the way across the top that's awesome i've i've heard about this mask i'm very excited to test it let's put it on and we bought this at like walgreens or something oh wow that nose wire is awesome Holy crap, that's a great nose wire. I, that seal is just so good. I just feel sealed here, people. Ooh, loud. Um, the smell, I'm getting a slight plasticky smell. Like uh, maybe I'm gonna call this uh, a small Lego plastic train set. Um, yeah, but it's not horrible. Um, and then the, but you can see like it's, it's got this like extra, the way that the, uh, the design is done, it's actually puffing out a little bit more than usual. So that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Tug on the mask. Dude, look at this thing. It maintains its shape. Wow. That's crazy. Usually it comes out a little bit. I could tell when I was pulling it off that the shape was, was good. Oh my gosh. This mask is interesting. Somebody loves masks here. I don't know who it is. All right. I'm going to try the, uh, the ear loops. Oh, 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 what? What? This is a great, I mean, that's, this is, wow, this is a great mask. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> what the? I've never had that happen before. What the actual hell? Did, what is going on here? I, that tore so easily, it's almost like, because you have to, like, when you open it, if I just was, like, aggressively <laughs> opening the bag, it would tear. What is going on? This is made out of some different material. This is like a paper. Okay, this is... Okay, I've tested hundreds of masks and I, like, I'm not used to seeing new things. This is all new. Okay, so you've got this layer of... Yeah, this is not polypropylene. It's like paper. It's like paper. It's like actual paper. Weird. And then you got a, a melt blown layer. Oh my gosh, what is going on here? So most, most masks, spun bond polypropylene on the outside, melt blown on the inside, spun bond polypropylene next to your face. This is like some cellulose paper stuff instead of, but it, it like has a rigidity to it. And then this looks like some super sexy spun bond I've never seen before. Whoa, 
This is crazy. And then Melplon. The Melplon. Wow. Okay. Man, I did not expect this to happen. Um, the box is really great. It's not a soft touch box, but I mean, it's just like really nicely done. You got that little extra shine there. Medical grade face mask. That's a regulated term in the US. 99% bacterial filtration. That doesn't actually matter for COVID. It doesn't matter. It's weird that they're making that claim. And so they're saying this is the best possible surgical mask that you can buy in the United States. That is their claim. This machine here is supposed to test at uh, 98% or higher. I have not looked yet. I'm not, I haven't cheated this time because I've been blown away for many reasons by the cool mask and the fact that you can just like tear it in half. Like, let me, and that's with, that's tearing it in half with the plastic bag on it. It's like a therapy session here. All right, 98%, what do you think? Mm. Oh, 96.322, 96.322. And the airflow was 105 Pascals. Now, um, on this, uh, they're claiming that it's gonna be, so they're, uh, they're measuring differential pressures in millimeters of H2O, right? Which of, of course we all know translates to Pascal's. It's basically 10 times more. So I like Pascal's because it's easier to say than millimeters of H2O. It's a lot of words. Um, so I, I, I use Pascal's and our machine uses Pascal's. So it's just really easy to, to so they're basically saying it should be 50 Pascal's or better they were twice that, but I am doing a, a really aggressive test here. Uh, the ASTM standard doesn't specify the, uh, the the liters per minute. I'm doing the maximum that, that you can do inside of that standard. So uh, I'll give them the 105 Pascals. That's, that's, that's pretty good. 105 Pascals is pretty good. So I'm not gonna knock them on that, but 98%, 96.3. I said that we were gonna do faster reviews. That's what I said. I'm not gonna talk forever. I'm not gonna get excited. And the first one out of the gate, 28 minutes. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. Uh, you know, I, I appreciate you. And uh, you know what? I, I'll catch you on the next test, which is tomorrow at 10 a.m. Probably, probably. Catch you then.